Hello friends, in this video we will discuss about a numerical that is based on Rhesus factor. So, can a RH positive, RH positive couple have RH negative child? First, we know that this RH factor is controlled by R gene. And this R gene have two alleles that is capital R and small r. A person with two capital R allele is Rh is with Rh positive recess factor. And a person with one capital and one small r allele is also with Rh recess factor. And a person with Two small r allele is always a Rh negative factor. So, from this genotype, we can conclude that here this capital R is dominant allele and this small r is recessive allele. Now, let us look at this numerical. A person with Rh positive and uh, uh, sorry, a, can Rh positive, Rh positive couple have Rh negative child. So, suppose Rh husband have genotype capital R, capital R and wife also have genotype capital R, capital R. Then we know that by crossing these capital R, 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 capital R. So here in this cross, we can see that when both the couple is with homozygous dominant genotype. then all of the their children will be with Rh positive recess factor. Now, <laughs> look at another possibility when one of the couple is homozygous is with homozygous dominant genotype and another is with heterozygous. Dominant genotype. Now, look at the possibilities that is capital R, capital R, capital R, small r, capital R, capital R, capital R, small r. So, here you can see that all of the children are with Rh positive factor. All of the children will be with Rh positive recess factor. But the difference is in that case, two will be with homozygous dominant and two other will be with heterozygous dominant. But all the four, all of the, their children will be with Rh positive factor. Now, look at another possibility. If by chance both the couple are with heterozygous dominant genotype. If a couple is Rh positive, both in a couple are Rh with Rh positive recess factor, then there may be chance both of them are homozygous dominant and there may be chance that one is homo, he, he, uh, homozygous dominant and another is heterozygous dominant. And there is also a possibility that both may be heterozygous dominant. If by chance both are heterozygous dominant, then there will be capital R, capital R, capital R, small r, small r, capital R, small r, small r. Here you can see that out of four children, three are with Rh positive factor and one is with Rh negative factor. 
and out of these three, two are heterozygous dominant and one is homozygous dominant. So, our question was can a RS positive, RS positive couple have RS negative child? Yes. RS positive, RS positive couple can have RS negative child only if both are heterozygous dominant with RH factor. <laughs> so, <clears throat> here we can count possibilities. Four children from this cross, four from this and four from this. So, we have total 12 children. Out of 12, only one is RH negative. So, there is possibility of around 8% of having RH negative child. But, if a couple is with heterozygous dominant recess factor, then there is out of 4, you can see that one is with RH negative factor. So, here when we talk about this case, when both are heterozygous dominant, then there will be 25% probability of having RH negative factor. So, a couple with RH positive, RH positive recess factor can have RH negative child. It, they can have RH negative child only when both are heterozygous dominant. 